I look like a mess. But it's only gonna get worse. <laughs> Hi everybody, it's Bambi. So what today's video is going to be a um building my bookshelves and organizing my bookshelf. I don't have any bookshelves in my new apartment, so and my room is not exactly set up to have books as such. Like bookshelves, I don't really have a lot of wall space, but I am fixing that because I need books. So yeah, it is currently seven, almost quarter past seven. My hair is crazy, I don't know what it's doing. Um, I haven't e eaten dinner yet and I was also hoping on trying to do a 24 hour readathon, but that will be another video. <laughs> I have four bookshelves that I bought from the ever so lovely Kmart. All my Aussies know what I'm talking about. Um, but basically they are just cubed units um, and I have them in a really nice sort of light brown color because most of my room is white and I kind of thought about getting white bookshelves and I went no nah, I don't really like that idea so they are brown and I have two four cube units and then two eight cube units so you guys are gonna follow and watch me as I build these bookshelves they're not bookshelves I keep calling them bookshelves but they're not bookshelves but Yes, hopefully I get this done within like the hour, two hours, um, and then I can eat. I want to finish Passenger by Alexandra Bracken. I have about a hundred-ish pages left of it. Um, it's okay. It's all right. Um, so I'm going to try and finish that. Um, and then for the 24-hour readathon video, I want to try and read The Night Circus by Erin Morganston. I want to try and read this in 24 hours just because I've had this sitting on my shelf for over like four years so I need to get this I need to read this I've heard amazing things about this so let's just get sorted I don't know how well this building process is going to be because I do have acrylics on and they are quite long um, and I do have a three-month-old kitten who enjoys playing with everything on the floor. Isn't that right, Louie? He's asleep at the moment. But let's get building! I am just in the middle of watching some booktube. I have been binge-watching Brittany the Bibliophile. I love her so much. Wish I could be her friend. But yeah, I've just been watching that all night and then finally decided to get up off my buttocks and actually build these shelves so uh, yeah just have that playing in the background and um, doing this so let's get building oh god so, yeah today was not the most successful first day of which when I get back from your house Buddy helping. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Ugh, I don't know where to put the 
camera. Ugh. I have one done! Yay! That took me almost half an hour. Yay! With this one disrupting me the entire time. So, oh wow I look rough. So I think I'm going to first get something to eat because I'm a little bit hungry and then I will continue on building. Yay. It seems that Mr. Prince has taken a liking to the new bookshelf. And there goes Louie. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it, Prince. Second shelf is now done. <sighs> That's what the two of them look like together. That took me so much longer for some unknown reason. It was just being a not nice person. And I also just realized I think I might have put them in wrong. Or used the wrong pieces. It has this little bit here whereas this one it's like perfectly Ugh. this is why i should not build things i don't even know what the time is right now 9 14 oh gosh i look like a mess holy crap i have hair in my mouth Ugh. so i actually wanted to start my 24 hour readathon at 9 45 and i still have two uh, much bigger bookshelves to make so I might just <laughs> I and I still haven't had a shower yet so I might just leave the making of the other two for tomorrow and pick that up there hey 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 oh far out man I don't know what to do I'll figure it out I'll go and have a shower and then come back and let you guys know what I'm gonna plan on doing. <laughs> I decided to make the shelf so this is the eight cubed with the four cubed on top. That A cubed was a lot harder to put together than I had originally thought. I look like a hot mess. I don't even know what time it is. I don't even know where my phone is. No, I think I do. I have bookshelves and I still have one to make. Um, I was originally planning on... Sorry, I'm just closing my curtains. Um, putting the shelves, like, beside each other in the corner, but... Uh, it doesn't... It doesn't fit well and it looks weird and I don't know what to do. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder if, hmm, okay, hold that thought. This lighting is amazing, doing wonders for me. All right, and yes, I'm wearing Pooh Bear PJs. Well, would you look at that? It will fit. Huh. I just need to do something about the curtains. The curtains are very annoying. Hey, Louie. What do you think, buddy? Now I'm just going to go and grab all my books and put them on there in no particular order at all just to get them off my shelf and out of my wardrobe. All right, let's do it.
Okay, so this is how it's looking so far. I do have to buy some more books. Unfortunately, I did give a lot away when I moved. Um, so I do have quite a few empty spaces, um, but that will be filled out within the next few months as I get back into buying books and things. Um, if you guys have any recommendations, please leave them down below. This will probably end up changing a few more times depending um, on how many books and stuff I get. Like the Shadow Hunter shelf is obviously going to end up spanning across a few more shelves because as you can see I don't have the rest of the Dark Artifices series as well as the new Chain of Gold series and I also am going to be getting a new box set of the this edition of the model instrument series because these ones are from when they were like very first published so they are looking uh, just a little bit old and unfortunately where I live in Australia it is the tropics and so humidity does play a bit of a factor in aging the books quite quickly like as you can see I've only had my copy of whatever the series is I can't even remember I've only had my copy of Assassin's Blade and Throne of Glass. Ew, there's a bug on it! Ah! Um, I've only had these for a couple of years. I bought them back in 2016 and they're already beginning to go a little bit yellow. Um, and I do plan on buying the hardcovers of these because Sarah J Maas is my favourite author. So I do plan on getting them which will probably mean that it will end up spanning across two shelves again. Um, I plan on continuing my V.E. Schwab collection or Victoria Schwab collection. Um, I absolutely love her writing. She is like my second favorite author. So her books are going to end up being on just like one shelf basically. Um, and yeah, I have at the bottom just my my older series that I love, like the Iron Face series. They were my first ever Fae series that I read. They were incredible. Um, so I just have those in the bottom there because they are slightly heavy. So I'm hoping because this is unfortunately not very stable. <laughs> so I'm hoping that if I put some of my heavier books down the bottom, it will make that balanced. I don't know. It's late and I just wanted to read my book but yeah. I think it'll be fine. Let's just hope that none of my cats jump on it. So there is definitely room for my books to grow and I have a, a lot to buy but um, that can be for later on. So this is a few days later and I finally have the other shelf built as you guys would have seen in my last video. Um, so it's got the books that I bought recently in it, like the Harry Potter um, books and things like that. So yeah, I am still looking at buying more of these shelves because I do really like them. I just think they're a little bit small, um, but I'm still not sure of where to put them exactly. Um, but yeah. So I thought I would give you guys a full view of the bookshelf. So that's what it looks like. Excuse the messy bit of the bottom. But yeah. I'm just editing the video over there as you can see. Uh, so yeah, that's what it looks like. So, oh my god. <laughs> So basically, I'm going to leave it here for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed me struggling um, and also yelling at my kitten while he decides to completely wreck everything. But, you know, he's adorable and that's fine. Um, let me know if you guys have any some... Oh, wow. English. Let me know if you guys have any recommendations and I will check some of them out. No, don't eat my fairy lights! Um, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe. I will be posting more videos soon. I have a couple of book tag videos that I'm going to be doing and some wrap ups and things like that. If you guys have any video ideas that you want me to do then please list them down below in the comments. What are you doing, Bubba? 
No, you can't eat the camera. Please don't. Um, I'm going to read my book and go to bed. <laughs> uh, uh. But I am actually so happy that I have a bookshelf now. <laughs> like, just like walking back into my room from grabbing all of my books from outside and seeing that like I have a bookshelf there, I was like, oh my god. <laughs> So yeah, I'm actually really happy that I have a bookshelf now. Anyway, I'm gonna go to bed because I am tired. <sighs> and to think I thought I was gonna be able to do a 24 hour readathon. Maybe next weekend. Okay guys, I will see you next time. Bye!